Happy Labor Day, you two. I had a video request from a viewer from a uh, from the other video I did of this vacuum working. They wanted me to do a video on how to change the bag on these uh, Eureka Ironside canister, power team canisters. So, I got two different bags out here. I got, uh, they're both generics. I got uh, Design to Fit Eureka Style S and uh, Eureka Style B. Now, either one of these iron sides can accept a B or an S bag. It's kind of weird, but the newer models just say B, and the uh, older models of, I want to say, up until about 1979-1980 only say take an S style bag. But as you can see, I got the hose off, uh, so we'll just open up the machine. There's a lift tab in the back. Okay, it opens up like that. Let's see, here's your full bag. And your pre-motor filter, which is pretty dirty. It collects all the fine particles. Um, so, this model is a 1743. Came out in 1981. So, it's like a transition year. It will either accept uh, Eureka Style S or Eureka Style B. And there's instructions... Um, how to install and remove those bags uh, They're very similar in shape and size, but they're a quite They have a few differences, excuse me That I like to show you so we'll Get back to that in a minute yeah, The bags quite full so you just uh, Hair just came cat hair just came out of there um, So as you can see it's a model 1743A, eight and a half amps, 120 volt AC, 60 hertz, serial number 229-54602, the Eureka Company, Bloomington, Illinois, 61701, and it was inspected by number 81, whoever that is. Quality right there. Isn't it great these old vacuum cleaners you actually get inspection stickers and you know it was inspected before it left the factory, you know? This is back when they knew how to make vacuum cleaners and they actually took pride in their work. But anyway, let me take out the bags. This is a Eureka Style S. I don't have any genuine bags right now. These are just generics, but they do the job. The fill treat's a little better. Paper, so here's your filter, free motor filter, style S. Here's the front. You see, it kind of, when you pull it out, it actually fans out like a big um, fan type of deal. And then, Style B. It's a little different. That's your style B. So you can see there are some differences in the bags between S and B. But they fit in there the same way and they're the same capacity size bags oh yeah and it also comes with two motor filters for two bags uh, that's what's currently in the machine now is a filtry Eureka B which I'm going to be removing so we open up the machine again just like a clamshell. I know it's hard to do this with one hand. And then we'll remove the filter, the dirty filter. Like so. Then we'll remove the bag. We'll remove the dirty bag like so. 
quite full. It's about three more than three quarters full. And they say to change the bags at three quarters full anyway to maintain airflow and suction. It's a little dusty in there, but so we're gonna use our S style bag. So first I'll put on the pre-motor filter. Make sure you get it under the tabs. So, so it doesn't come off. And again, that's to collect the fine dust particles that don't get trapped inside the back so you don't burn up your, your motor. And again, style S. Fit it, the cardboard fitting over the collar. Oh, this is way hard to do with one hand. I have to set the camera down here. Okay, oh, this is not going to work, alright. So it fits over the collar like this, and then there's two pins, and you just fit the cardboard over like that, over the two pins, and fold this top part back, okay. And then, once that's in place, where it says to pull, we're gonna pull the bag apart. The sides of the bag apart. Oh man, this is being a pain in the ass here. Oh, I gotta put the camera down. There you have it. You just fan everything out. And there's your new S style bag. Ready to go. Just like that. Now I just close the lid, making sure there's no bag edges outside the machine caught, and we're ready to go again. It's ready to go back to work. So, 
Here's just a little instruction video on how to change the bags in these uh, Eureka Power Team canisters. Alright, well, you have a good day now, and uh, bye.